Hello and welcome to this new video. It is part of a series, so if you are new, please take a look to the previous videos because they are all connected. You will find the link on the description below. Today we will see how to deal with a string object. This will be very useful later to deal with HTTP request or any kind of a strings. The string object variable has a special category because there is a lot of blocks inside. First, you need to declare the variable. Declaring is like asking the board to have a box or space where we will put a string object. With the string, we use always the double quote. The sample quote is used only with the character variable. The declare block should be called only once in the setup part. We use the block set to put a string into our variable. In our example, I will put the text welcome in the variable. In the end, I will display the content of my variable on the serial monitor. Here, I am changing the name of the variable. Now I can upload the program and see the result. Now I will see how this block works. To have an idea about that, right click on the block and then click on the help button. As you can see, uh, the block accepts a number and will return the position of the character in that place. In every string, the index of the first character is 0 and the second is 1. So, uh, I will verify this now. And this is the result. As you can see, the index 0 is held by the W character and the index 1 is held by the character E. Now we will see how the block compare works. First, take a look at the documentation. So, this block will compare our variable to another string and will return a number. This number is 0 if uh, the two strings are equal, otherwise it will be another number. Let's test uh, that. I will compare my variable to the text hello. I got here a number different from 0, which means that the two strings are completely different. I will improve the display by displaying a better message.
Now let's test uh, the block index of. It returns the position of the first occurrence of uh, a character given as a parameter. In this example, I will show the position of the character C. And this is uh, the position. By the same way, I invite you to test uh, the other blocks. First, read the documentation and then uh, make your own uh, example. I hope that you liked the video and see you soon. Bye.